Hey, what's up? It's Mr. J with Sign the Fly. Stay tuned to find out how I turn this bulb on without plugging it in. All right, before we get started here, I need to talk a little bit about the plasma ball itself. Now, these can be found in a lot of different kind of novelty type stores, um, but how it works is inside this sphere, you have different kinds of gases and mixtures of gases. Now, those gases are charged or excited um, by the electricity that is in that center sphere there. Now, whenever they're charged, they light up and give a really cool display. Depending on what kind of gas is in the sphere determines what color you're going to see. That's how you can see some of these plasma balls with blues and greens and yellows and oranges and reds and pinks and purples. It all depends on the mixture of gas that's inside of the, the sphere. Now, those charged particles, they want to get out. All right? they're, they're, they're trying to get out and they're, they're just doing this thing. Now, what I can do that's really cool about this is I can take my finger and I can place it on the sphere and I get this tracking motion, this path to where there are multiple charged particles that are connecting with my finger point right there. Pretty cool. But if that's all I was going to show you, that would be kind of a boring video because most people that have plasma walls know that you can do that. What's really cool that I found includes light bulbs. Now, right here we have the old traditional incandescent light bulb. And the way this works are, this is two prongs that kind of come up through the center that's connected with what's called a filament. That filament is what gets hot and lights up, giving us light. The problem with incandescent bulbs is it produces more heat than it does light. Most of the energy that's produced from this light bulb is heat. And that's not what we want unless you're doing something with an easy bake oven. So we're actually wasting energy. We want to conserve energy and we want a light bulb that's giving mostly light, not mostly heat. That's where scientists have come together with this. You've probably seen these around and these are called CFLs or compact fluorescent light bulbs. Now the way these work is the exact same way as these tubes work that you're probably familiar with as well and they work exactly the same as the plasma balls. It's connected, it's filled with different types of gases that are just waiting to get charged up, they're waiting to get excited, okay, via electricity. But that's not the only way I can excite the particles that are in this light bulb. All I have to do is get it near other particles that are excited or charged up as well. Watch this. Might be a little hard to see, so I'm going to shut off the lights. Hang tight. So the lights are off and I'm going to start off with the old traditional incandescent light bulb. Now what I'm going to do with this, it's not plugged in anything, I'm just holding it in my hand and I'm going to take it and I'm going to put it near the plasma ball. Now you see, nothing is happening. Nothing at all. This is not filled with gas that is ready to get charged up and excited. This is filled with two prongs that have a connecting filament. Nothing is going to happen. If I take the old CFL now, the compact fluorescent bulb, the one that's filled with gases that are just waiting to get charged up and excited, and all I have to do is get it near the plasma ball. Pretty epic. Look how, look how far away I am, how close I don't need to be. And it lights up. Pretty awesome. The last thing I'd like to show you is with the 48 inch fluorescent bulb. These are the, the large two bulbs that are in a lot of buildings, in the, in, the, in the ceilings of buildings. And I'm just holding it up and all I have to do is get it near the plasma bowl. Bam. Not plugged in anything. All I'm doing is charging the particles that are inside of this bulb with the already charged particles of the plasma bowl. It's been Mr. J with Sign the Fly, the place where science makes sense. <laughs>